Everyone, this weekend, the San Diego County Sheriff's Department will be hosting a gun buyback event in San Marcos. Lieutenant Michael Aaron's here from the San Marcos Sheriff's Station joining us this morning to tell us a little bit more about all of this. A great opportunity for uh, people to uh, get rid of the guns that they potentially don't want here with the San Diego Car County Sheriff's Department here. I uh, appreciate you bringing in um, some examples of what people can get rid of if they no longer want a gun in the household, right? Correct. And uh, we're partnering with the city of San Marcos, the district attorney's office, the Oceanside, Carlsbad, and Escondido Police Departments, the Palomar College Police Department, the California State University San Marcos Police Department, and Project Child Safe. Wow, to so lots of agencies lots involved. Lots of agencies yeah. to remove unwanted firearms from our communities. And we're also um, giving out um, free cable locks if um, people want to keep their guns and be able to secure them in their house so that children won't get them. Okay, so two options. You can get rid of your gun if you don't want it anymore, and you get what? You'll get a $100 gift card for any rifle, handgun, or shotgun, and then we'll give you a $200 gift card if you bring in an assault weapon or a ghost gun. Wow, okay, and that's to Target or other places? or Target, Shell. Oh, okay, uh, yeah. wow, okay, and then if you have a gun and you're a responsible gun owner and you want to keep that gun and you responsibly want to have it locked up, that's what these are right here? Can you yeah, explain these, are, these? Yeah, these are cable locks. And basically, those will usually run through where the magazine feeds in, and it prevents the gun from, from being, being able to chamber armed. around or anything. Yes. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Uh, let's talk about, um, I mean, we recently had another school shooting in, uh, in Denver here. Um, we have lots of guns out in the community, and they need to be responsibly used. Um, so how, how is this event going to help in that effort? Well, obviously, a lot of people inherit guns. They don't know what to do with guns, so, and they don't like guns, so we're going to help them get rid of their unwanted guns. And at the same time, uh, responsible owners that want to keep their guns um, will provide uh, free cable locks, and they can secure the guns at home and also make sure that children don't have access to those guns. So this happens um, every few months or so. Uh, the last gun buyback event the Sheriff's Department hosted was in December in La Mesa. Um, what were some of the results of that? Were a lot of people showing up, getting rid of the yeah. guns they didn't need? We collected about 150 guns at that event. Wow, okay. That's good. Uh, do these kind of events help reduce crime in our community? Do you think by having these gun buyback events or offering the locks, this is helping out uh, and, and bring down those, those crime rates with guns in, in the community. Have you guys seen a correlation with that? Any, anytime you're taking unwanted guns off the street, that's uh, taking away an opportunity for a gun to get stolen, a gun to get used in a crime. And not only that, um, providing uh, cable locks for responsible owners, then we will be preventing children from accessing firearms if they want to keep them. Lieutenant, if someone can't make it out this weekend, but they've been thinking about getting rid of their gun, or like you said, they inherited some a, a gun and they don't know what to do with it, they can't make it to this weekend's event. You guys have these frequently. What are What's the, kind of the timeline of other opportunities? So to we're going to have two more this year. Um, and even if you don't want to come out to a gun buyback event, you can also contact your local police department. Um, make arrangements to turn over your guns. The only issue is you're not going to get a gift card. There you go. That. Okay. So. Uh, but there is an opportunity um, for you to, if you right now uh, do have a gun that you don't want, you can go to many places to get rid of that firearm, right? Yeah, you can pretty much call any law enforcement. And just uh, turn it in. No questions in. asked. No questions okay. asked. Okay. Yeah. Uh, let's talk about um, a, a little bit about this event. Um, allowing people to discard of this the, the right way. There are uh, many gun owners out there who uh, store them properly and everything. Mm -hmm. The message to, to gun owners out there that are um, doing the right thing with their weapons or for those that maybe are confused about what some of the rules and laws are, what can those people be doing? Uh, yeah, we just want you to responsibly store your weapons, and the, the majority of firearm owners do. They, they responsibly store them, but there's some people that just, you know, like I said, inherit them, don't want them, don't know a lot about them, they're not comfortable with them, and we'll give them the opportunity to give them back. And then those that want to keep them, we'll give them the opportunity to be able to store them safely. A very important message here, that's for sure. Lieutenant, thanks for coming on and telling Thank us you. about this great event. And again, it's this weekend? It is this weekend, Saturday, March 25th, from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m., the San Marcos Sheriff Station, 182 Centaur Place in All San right. Marcos. Thank you, Lieutenant. Really appreciate it.